Hey guys, what is up? The Neocubist here, and today I will be reviewing Elis Craft by Elis himself. This is a 16 by 16 texture pack, and yeah, let's get started. So the first texture you see here are stone half slabs. All the textures do fit smoothly together, and they are very, very nice. Right here you can see the cobblestone. Right here are the smooth sandstone chiseled sandstone and normal sandstone right here are the gold blocks right here are the diamond blocks iron blocks redstone ore diamond ore lapis ore emerald ore iron ore and gold ore and up here you will see all of the types of wood so we have oak wood right here spruce wood jungle wood and birch wood on the back we have the respective planks so the birch planks the jungle planks the spruce planks and the oak planks. Now it looks like these two textures are the same. I guess they'll be changed. I do not know right now. Now this is a work in progress texture pack so not everything is complete. So I'm just going to fly around here and before I do that let me show you just some items that have been changed. So the rails you can see their textures are done. Look very nice. So we'll have all of these. Let's go ahead and just grab some of these machines. Note block, sticky piston, normal piston, some TNT. Grab a lever. Now I do not know if the um, explosion has changed. I'm going to go ahead and test that out right here. So as of right now, the explosion texture has not changed. Right here you can see some dirt. Looks very nice. Right here is a dispenser. Right here is a note block. And again, guys, I know what these are called. I just want you guys to be able to see them. The notes have not changed. This is a sticky piston. Normal piston. So let's go ahead and extend these show you guys how they look and right here is the TNT as I just showed you and let's go over here to a cave and see how everything looks underground so I'm gonna go ahead and switch into a more cinematic view right here and as you can see everything looks very nice in a cave I'm gonna go really deep underground and show you guys some more underground footage when I come back okay guys so I have just dug around a little bit underground and I am he here to show you the torch texture and the redstone torch texture and a bedrock and here's some smooth stone naturally now I'm gonna go find a cave and find something even better for you guys so I'll be right back okay guys but before I do that I'd like to just show you how the world looks in itself so right here you can see a snow biome everything looks very nice and I'm gonna show you some underground footage in here in just a sec I plan this out perfectly I hope not the best planner. Here you, here you can see a plains biome with a couple of trees. Trees look very nice. And right here is our cave that we'll, we, we will be exploring. Sorry about that. Let's go ahead and turn this off because it is kind of hard when there's lighting errors. Now this is not the texture pack. This is just Minecraft being stupid. Turn up the brightness. So as you can see under here everything looks really nice. And sorry about that guys. That's part of a mod. Everything looks really nice. Just want to go ahead and put that out there. I would rate this texture pack right now, and I have not seen the nether yet. Well, I have, but I haven't showed you guys it. Um, well, I'm not going to give the rating yet. I'm going to wait, wait till I show you guys the nether. So, let's go to that now. Okay, guys, I know you guys were wondering what this is. I saw it too. I thought it was pretty interesting, so I'm just going to show you it real quick. looks really really nice so okay back to what we're gonna do okay guys so right now I thought it'd be a good opportunity to go ahead and show you that the rain texture is not changed again this is work in progress don't judge it as of right now although you can play with it it's just fine and right here you can go ahead and see the obsidian textures looks really nice portal textures the same I'll meet you in the nether and my oh my does the nether look incredible honestly this is where alias craft or Elis Craft, sorry, shines. It is very, very beautiful. Every texture flows so perfectly together, and even the new textures such as these, not necessarily new, but, you know, added by Jeb. I consider those things new. Everything looks perfect, including the nether wart texture, which really does look like it should. I do not like the normal nether wart texture. Right here is a red mushroom, if you did not catch that earlier. Go ahead and make it where I can place a torch. So as I move along here, I'm going to show you guys some more. 
nether. So let's go ahead and just break out of here real quick. It appears as though I am underground, so I'm going to find my way out and come right back. Okay, guys, just found my way out here. Here's the glowstone texture. Looks really nice. Very pretty. Very basic. So right here, this is going to be the last part of the mod review. I'm going to go ahead and show you some of the, some more of the textures. Let's go ahead and just light up the area. Yeah, let's turn off that. It gets annoying after a while. Let's go ahead and show you the tools right here. The tools have not been textured yet. These are not part of the thing. That's just part of a mod. If you want to see that, you can go ahead and just click right here. Right here. And I'll show you. Okay, so here is this. Hasn't changed. And neither have these. And these haven't either. But guys, keep in mind, this is not complete yet. So do not judge it as of now. Now, I, wanna, I do want to show you something that I thought would look really nice. The chest texture. I thought it was just really cool. So yeah, guys, I'm going to go ahead and give this texture pack a 10 out of 10. Now, I do rate things honestly, and honestly, this is probably my favorite texture pack. I definitely want to see where this texture pack goes, and I hope this video stays on there for a while. So yeah, if you like my texture pack review, go ahead and give it a like. If you want to see more things like this, tutorials, reviews, let's plays, things like that, go ahead and click that subscribe button right in the middle of the screen. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.